Tobin, you've been here for four seasons. How were you able to go from your first year, which before they only won five games, you won 15 games your first year, to get to the Elite Eight last year? How were you able to do that? Well, I mean, as you, as you know, Coach, good good players. We have, we have good players and, and good kids, and we were able to get a little bit lucky in recruiting, get a couple guys that, that, that uh, um, you know, worked hard, got better, um, you know, came and kind of surprised us a little bit. Got a couple guys who were under-recruited, a kid from uh, Chaz Watler from Archbishop of Malloy who, who was basically had no scholarship offers and comes wow. in and scores 2,000 points, and we didn't expect that. And then we get, you know, a guy like Justin Reyes who's been great for us. So um, good kids, a lot of help from the administration, a lot of support from the from the – from people, once you get it going a little bit, of steam, steam rolled a little bit. We, we, we got to go on and start winning some games, and guys got a little more um, felt better about what was going on. And we just kind of uh, we're, we're we're a tough, gritty bunch of guys, and that's been it's been fun to coach guys who have a little bit of a chip on their shoulder. And so uh, now let's hopefully now take the next step and get even even better, and and, and, and take you know and try to get to a Final Four to a national championship. And it's it's out there. We can do it, but it's going to be a, be a lot of work. Now you have a very exciting style, up tempo, pressing and running. Who are the influences that gave you this? Philosophy. Yeah, well, I mean, I think uh, Coach Patino at Kentucky, just watching his teams play back when they had Mashburn and all those guys there, and, 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 and yeah, obviously, yeah, he had a lot of good players, but, uh, you know, how, how fast they played. I think um, for us, we can recruit guys, I think, at this level who, who can fit that style. We have a lot of guys. And I, I like to play a lot of guys, so this allows us to play more, more guys and, and, and go a little bit deeper and make conditioning a factor. And so Coach Patino influenced me a lot. And then once we, you know, we, we're playing in, we're not playing in a big arena here, as you can see. We're, we're playing in a place that I think is conducive for us to be able to um, turn the heat up a little bit in this gym, make it hot in here. And uh, create turnovers and create an exciting style of play. And, and you know we're not we're not we're not a finesse team. We're not a, we're not a, a, an outside shooting three point shooting team. So if we can create easy shots and get the ball up, up the floor, it's a it's a fun way to play. And I think uh, our guys enjoy it. You lost some terrific plays from last year, yep. Watler and Cust. Yep. What is your biggest challenge coming into this season? I think it's going to be uh, just interesting to to blend in seven guys who are who are back who have. Tremendous experience, you know, Justin Reyes, who's a fifth-year senior, Jules DeCourtney, who's a, who's a fifth-year senior, with, uh, with, with six – or no, eight, actually eight new guys who are very talented, but they're also new. So just trying to, to blend those new guys and the old guys together. And like anything, it's going to take some time. Like, we're not expecting instant success. It's going to probably take us until, until January and February to, to play our best basketball. But I think if we can get to that point and just keep on getting better, right. we'll, be, uh, we'll be pretty good. Great.